guys, good morning. Um, this is Nanda coming to you from Gardening and Karma. Just want to quickly bring you through the process of um, how I plant my ranunculus. Um, these are corns. What I have here is a, a pastel blend. And these things are ugly. This is what they look like. I don't know. They look like spiders or octopus or anyways they look dead so all, you, all we do for these things is that we soak them in water for about two to four hours four to six really dependent they like oxygen oxygen gives them that um plumpness that they need um first to plant uh, so some people use like a, a, a aquarium pump. What I did, I don't have any of that. So I just I just filled the bucket, this bucket right here. I don't know if you can see it. This bucket right here with water and I had it under the sink and I had the water trickle in a little bit. So this way the bubbles would form the oxygen that it, it needs. So I just kind of left these aside to give you an example of what they look like before soaking and i let mine soak overnight last night because the four hour range was not doing it for me so um this morning they went from this to this so that's basically what they look like so i'm gonna put those in the water and all I'm going to be doing now is I'm going to be setting these down in, in soil, regular potted soil. I'm going to cover them and then I'm going to put them in my basement for about two weeks. Two weeks and I'm going to watch them. I'm not really going to water it unless it dries out. I'm going to put them in the basement and um, in two weeks time I should see um, growth. And after that, then I'm gonna I'm going to plant them outside because they're very cold tolerant, and um, hopefully, hopefully I get them for spring. Get the blooms for spring. So here we go, guys. Just very quickly, I'm just gonna plant these up because I gotta get ready for work. We actually plant them like this. This is where the shoots will come out of. So it's face down this way. I'm trying to get the bigger ones out. So put them in here. I really hope that this mix survives because no experience at all with doing this my first first time and I don't know what I'm doing but I'm giving it a shot it's early early morning I don't know about almost eight I gotta feed the dogs take a shower and get out of here the roads are not the best because it snowed yesterday. So I need to leave a little bit early today. Yeah, guys, so basically that's it. Just kind of setting them down here in the soil. I'm going to cover them lightly. Like I said, I'm not going to water them for until uh, I see um, growth. Really, that should be no more than two weeks from now. And so, when that happens, also I have the option to transplant them outside in the landscape and watch them come up in the spring. Yeah. 
Actually, let me just put on the penny here. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, going to survive or what I'm going to get out of them, but I'm going to jam them in here anyways because these, um, these plants are, these flowers are so beautiful and I love to use them in my, in my bouquets. So now I'm just going to cover, I already have the soil pre-done, I'm just going to lightly cover all of them. I don't have enough soil, so I'm kind of like pinching. I'm going to have to get some more soil later. Lowe's are one of those stores. I don't know if they have soil left, but we'll see. This is what it looks like. I just basically covered all of them. And I'm going to put them in the basement, store them there, watch them, make sure that they're not going to be completely dried out. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you for watching. And um, I'll see you in the next video. If you like this channel, again, please subscribe, hit the like button. And hit the notification as well so this way you can know when I'm making new videos. Thanks again. Have a good morning.